we are gathering data on the mammals along these same transects that we're gathering the oceanographic data. These animals are very closely related to um, these oceanographic processes, and so we can help uh, get information about interactions with oil spills and things like that. It's an inventory too, just to know like what's out there, what's in the in the sound um, in different areas, and finding out some of the different regions that are really important for these animals. We have a program called D-Log, an observer program, and we put in various parameters, like the weather conditions and the sea conditions and things like that. And then we make observations from 150 meters on each side of the vessel, and we have different bins that we put them in, so 50 meters within the vessel, and then 50 to 100 meters within the vessel, and then 100 to 150 meters within the vessel. And beyond that is a separate bin, but we can gather information about how close these animals are to the vessel. We've seen humpback whales, orcas, golf porpoise. Uh, I've seen a lot of um, fork tail storm petrels, common murs, puffins. We've even seen some loons, some marbled murrelets, uh, pigeon guillemots, um, ancient murrelets. We got to see some of those, so that was exciting. I'm just kind of doing the um, observing and then um, the Prince William Sound Science Center has a protocols to um, look at the abundance and distribution. I'm super excited to be out here and just out in the element and, and seeing the wildlife and this has been great.